Jim Brown, you're yeah. running the creamery, and we, boy, you do a great job. Thanks for coming. You're welcome. You only say that because I brought a lot of food. <laughs> with me. Well, that's a big part of it. Yeah. You know, well, it's okay. I'm but used you're used to, to that. I, I am exactly used to it. Say. Let's pull out. Well, so the the cool thing about these ice cream sandwiches is you're saying we can get them at every Commonwealth campus now. Yes, and you can get them on campus anywhere here. And these are actually made from uh, cookies from the bakery here at Penn State. Wow. The, so yeah. And also, I was fascinated to hear these are made by hand. Every ice cream sandwich that you guys sell is made by hand. That is correct. And the wonderful. Part about that is in the first two weeks of classes started, we made 1,900 of these by hand. Wow! The students, all the students, students do it. Is that yes. the people in food science probably? Right? Uh, well, well, or we do. This, we do. Yeah. We have employees. Yeah, he couldn't wait any longer. He's <laughs> talking too much. I don't need to talk. All right. Well, uh, yeah, you, I guess I'll do see, the talk. I okay. Had it opened yeah. up for so, you. so what else you got? What's your? What are the most well, popular all, flavors? First of oh, all, before you eat that, I was going to eat it here. You can talk about it. No. This is the peanut butter swirl cookie sandwich. So it has uh, peanut butter swirl ice cream with chocolate chip cookie dough. Yeah. Try a bite, and okay. oh, we have off. vanilla here. <laughs> what did I tell you? You can't split it. Okay. And he, you, you got that part. Oh, got it's a good split. How is it? That now, is that, not, is that not a meal? <laughs> and by the way, yeah. you just said something in the fall. See, a lot of people think fall is is the determination of weather or vice versa. For yeah. us, falls is the events of the stadium and football, right. which means more business for us. So we love to see fall come. Fantastic. And, and, yeah. and every day is ice cream weather uh, of course. here at Penn State. Yeah. What are the top flavors, again, of your creamery ice cream? Well, we brought most of the top flavors mm -hmm. here. We do have Death by Chocolate, Bittersweet Mint, uh, Joe's favorite, My favorite over here. My favorite cookie dough right here. Cookie mm -hmm. dough. Uh, we have a new one that's called Monkey Business. Oh, I like that. And what else do you? Oh, Peachy Materno. And <laughs> and one of the reasons I bought most of these is because six or seven flavors are available at all times at every football event. And, and you know, I work at the stadium every game, and I get to see a lot of people inside, and they're all carrying around now. That is mm -hmm. correct. These l containers Great of ice cream. Great social media yeah. plugs yeah. for us all the time. And this year, their new flavor they're carrying this year, Joe, you'll like this, the Grilled Stickies. Oh, I love the Grilled Stickies, And we too, just started yeah. that last year. And just by starting it last year, it's, it's really ironic that it's one of the top five flavors so far this year wow. in every, everything that's sold. Hey, before we go, to, we got two minutes left. I wanted to show some folks, where's, where's that cheese and meat? I had it, but Joe ate it all. Oh, <laughs> my. No, no, there's tons. There's oh, yeah. <laughs> so this is, new, this is new that you guys have partnered with the Meat Labs. So when you go into the creamery, you also can get this stuff. And this is all made by students right here on campus across, the, right. across the street. We are part of the College of Agriculture, and the Meats Lab is also. And what the creamery believes in is not just the Penn State we are. I'm going to show, show that. Yeah. Yes. It is the Penn We are all Penn State. Yeah. So everything that everybody makes across Penn State, any union, any entity, we like to be able to incorporate it at the creamery and be able to sell it also. So and you said you can order this online too, right? Some of these soon, are, soon are some of, of these are yeah. already available online and the beef sticks will be soon. And we have a dilled pickle beef stick, which, which is really I like good. that idea. I know it sounds most people wouldn't like that no, idea. No, it's great. But, mm. I tried it today. It's one of the reasons I like working at the creamery. <laughs> okay, I got some used to ice cream. Taste, now I got other things yeah, to taste. Yeah. Now people want to know how is it that you can stay slim working at the creamery? Wow. Well, when you get so used to after 15 years of eating ice cream, it, it yeah. becomes commonplace. So you don't you don't yeah. eat it all you the only time. A little bit. Yeah. A little yeah, bit. Yeah. Very. Because I've yeah. tried every flavor. Yeah. And the only flavors I try is when we have new flavors. Yeah. That's why I said you have to come visit us more often. It gives me excuse to start <laughs> eating more. So. Fantastic. Well, this is cool, and it's exciting for you to be able to, to bring some new uh, Penn State products out in the market, and uh, and the fact that you can get so much more of this stuff all around the state is great. So Absolutely. you guys are getting bigger and better. We're, we're trying to make sure that everybody in Pennsylvania and everybody that's part of Penn State has a chance to try it, so that's why the Commonwealths are carrying it. Yeah, and uh, the, Thanks, the campuses that have most of it right now, you said there are three that have most all, of it. All of our Commonwealth campuses right now across Pennsylvania carry our ice cream. Three of them right now carry all of our dairy products. That's Altoona, Barron, and Hazleton. All right. Okay. What do you mean to be all of them? We've got to head to a break. Yep. Uh, we'll be back with much more here from Beaver Stadium. Stick around.